are my sunshine. About 50 million people in the world have dementia, and Alzheimer's is the most common form. The government and other scientists are now proposing a new way to define Alzheimer's, which will affect how many people are diagnosed with the disease. It will increase it, uh, I think, dramatically. Dr. Clifford Jack Jr. at the Mayo Clinic led a panel of experts who worked with the Alzheimer's Association and the National Institute on Aging to update guidelines on the disease. They want the new definition based on biological signs, such as brain changes as seen on scans, rather than memory loss and other symptoms. They would measure certain forms of two proteins that form plaques and tangles in the brain, as well as nerve injury, degeneration, or brain shrinkage. This proposal is really about acknowledging that there are biological brain changes that happen maybe 20 years before memory loss is even first detected. And it stresses that there's an opportunity to actually try to treat those biological changes early. The recommendations were published in Alzheimer's and Dementia, the journal of the Alzheimer's Association. It's too soon to use these scans in routine care. The goal is to improve research by using more objective criteria to pick patients for studies and enroll them sooner, when treatments may have a chance to help. Now, if you use the old definition of Alzheimer's disease, where the disease doesn't exist until symptoms are present, then it's really impossible to do a study where you enroll people and try to prevent symptoms. Dr. Jack stresses there's still no cure, but Alzheimer's experts see this development as progress. And it's important to include those earliest biological changes because we know that that's where we've had the most success in treating disease, in treating many other diseases like diabetes, HIV, uh, like cancers, like heart You're disease. Honestly, and we can do it also with Alzheimer's. A better way to find the disease before symptoms start. Carrie Antelfinger, Associated Press. Now with your leg.